Okay, hi everybody, it's Bonkai922. Change it up a bit. First impression stat. Um, the One Piece chapter review will come later. Uh, now there's a few first impressions I'm going to be doing for the fall. You know, we got Selector, Gundam, Builders Try, and... Oh, right. Lock Horizon Season 2, and this. Shaker. I think the, ja the Japanese, how you say it, his su Hitsugi no Chaika, Avenging Battle. Now, this season two, everyone who saw last season saw the conclusion of that. We had um, Gillette, Captain Gillette, who was part of that group that was chasing after Chaika. Apparently... Some things came to light in episode 3. About him, and if he was dead or not, and about the truths behind the checker in episode 4. So, this is going to be my, my first impressions on it. And, so far, holy shit. By the way, if you haven't, guys haven't seen episode 4 and 5, I suggest you go see it. It is redonkulous. <laughs> like... Like, basically, you get introduced to all these, like, mysterious creatures. Like, to name a few, um, Kraken, Unicorns, it is really crazy. They call them, um, Freyla, Freyla, or Freyla, or magical beings, I guess. And the thing is, is that... Now, this is only going to be 10 episodes, which is a bummer, because I'm like, you know, but I have a sinking, suspicious feeling. We also get introduced to this person, this Vita, who, I'm not going to spoil here, but she, she's another crazy individual, but it seems like... The truth behind the Chaikas, at, at first I thought it was going to be like, you know, um, they created clones, or like they, the Chaika, the original Chaika split herself up into different emotions. No. The explanation we got was a very physical one. And if anyone hasn't seen episode four, don't watch this video. I'm, put, I'm gonna put it in the, in the, in the first impressions so like spoilers, you know. But essentially, the whole story is that the emperor of Gaz, he never had a daughter. He never did. So what they did is they kidnapped the orphans on the streets and they made them in strikes. <laughs> it's just, it's blow, it blows my mind when I hear that shit. Like, now, currently there's only like about... There's really only three chikas we know of at this moment. And that's excluding the chika from season one. The one with the blue. Because she died. That douchebag of a duke guy. So, and they're basically tools. That, that was the whole bit. The Chaikas are tools and are to just go and get the remains of, of the emperor. And they, you know, this is, this is pretty fucked up. This is like, their memories are fake. They, it's it, it's pretty bad. That that revelation was was just oh what the fuck you know, but so far I'm going to say this might be better than season one. I mean, 
And rating wise so far, gonna stick I'm gonna say eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. First impressions. Eight out of ten, four out of five. Um it seems like it's gonna go in a different direction at the end of the season. And I'm really interested in seeing what's going to happen with Gillette. Because if that guy is Gillette, do we see in episode three? Holy shit. Because that's just going to be just a whole different scenario altogether. Now, I think what occurred when it concerns him is he might have gotten blasted by the blast, but didn't die. But maybe like he had amnesia or some shit like that, and now that's what happened. But it should be interesting down the road. But so, but so far, I'm going to say 8 out of 10, because a lot of interesting things happened in the first five episodes. And especially episode 3, 4, and 5. We found out some stuff. And got some interesting battle sequences also. Especially in episode 5. Episode 5 was sick. Yo, episode five was sick. Episode four and five, cause it's just a huge battle. You got the red chica, the white chica. You got these demi humans. Yeah, demi humans. It was fucking amazing. I really enjoyed it. But for now, I'm gonna say eight out of ten. Um, four out of five. Down the road, we'll see. I mean, we're talking five weeks from now. Essentially, because this is only going to be 10 episodes, so. But so far from what I've seen from Trika this season, this second season, it is definitely more better than uh, last season. Plus, we now get to see what the Emperor looked like. You know, Trika's not father. Father who, who decided to go kidnap orphans. <laughs> but... He's very, you know, weird looking. He's got white hair and shit. And supposedly, which was really, really fucked up. He was smiling when he was killed. <laughs> that blows me away. <sighs> but, at least to say, from what I've seen so far... This season of Chaika is definitely going to answer some more questions. We already got the whole Chaika thing out of the way. And it's only been, what, four episodes? Five episodes now? We already know. And it this Vita girl, which was introduced, she apparently is a fucking gun. Well, not really a gun. Now, that, that, that's She's like an extension of... Um, Chika's magic weapon she uses. And she apparently is reiterating to her that it is their destiny to collect the remains of the Emperor and everything else. I have a feeling down the road something huge is going to happen. Like, I would not be surprised no shit that if after they collect all the remains, he comes back to life. I'm dead serious. I have a feeling it's going to happen that way. But, hey, we're only on episode 5. So we'll have to wait and see. But, yeah, nothing else to add on this. Bonkai 922, 4 out of 5 for the first 5 episodes. This, this, is, this series... I got a feeling we're going to see more what the fucks. More what the fuck moments. Um, down the road. Next week's episode. Like. We, we see Gillette again. It's with Gillette. He's still alive. <laughs> and we also see. Um, the girl from his group. Who had a crush on. Um, her name eludes me at the moment. But. So I'm guessing this is going to coll collude. Con conclude where she's gonna end up seeing him eventually <laughs> and then you know 
butt to heads, give and take. But we'll see, we'll see. This this looks promising, this season of Chica, more so than last season. So we'll get some more answered questions answered as we go along. So yeah. Bonkai 922, I'll see you guys later. Jolette is alive and we now know the truth behind Chica's. This is fucking crazy. I'll see you guys later. Peace.